Well, we we did it last year after the mayor, uh, Marty Walsh, uh, asked together Boston, which is the festival, of course. So they came to us and said, would you like to throw a dance party at oh, City Hall wow. Plaza? That's pretty and, cool. And uh, we were completely, I couldn't believe that they were asking us about this. And then, uh, and then we did it again last year. Or we did it last year, and it was, you know, it was a lot of different types of people. Yeah, uh, People went. brought their skates. People, uh, you can rent the skates and roller skate on this kind of portable uh, disco rink that they have. Mm-hmm. Um, and, um, you know, just a lot of really positive vibes and dancing to disco music or We've got two great DJs that really know what they, they're doing, so uh, you can expect a whole lot of disco. Yeah, and, no, DJ uh, Khaled's and, one and of them. A few choice cuts from Donna, certainly, will, will make their appearance in there. Um, you know, and, and I kept saying on the mic last year that this was the first annual disco party. Uh, just uh, someone I, I knew uh, once told me that if you say it, uh, enough that it will come true. <laughs> so, uh, and when you know, they, they, they hit us back up and said, you know, we want to do this again. We want to do it everything exactly how it went before. Like, there's art, there's a, this, this chalk uh, artist that does this amazing stuff. And then, you know, um, and, and we said, yeah, let's just do everything. Yeah, let's, let's not change a thing. Very so, cool. And it's happening yeah. once again this Friday, this coming Friday? This Friday from 6 to 10 at City Hall Plaza, um, you know, uh, bring your kids, bring your family, whatever. Uh, you know, it's free, uh, over the public. Uh, probably, uh, you know, bring some water with you or what have you. Um, <laughs> it's, uh, it's free. So, you know, if you wanted to bring some food, you can do that, too. Um, and, you know, the family's really just really excited that this is happening. Oh, very uh, cool. You've been in contact with them. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. No, we. I wouldn't have moved forward without uh, without their approval. Uh, Robert Grant uh, yep. is an MC named Omega Red um, that you might have heard of yep. uh, around these parts. He he's Donna's nephew. Oh wow! And okay. The very last song that she ever sang uh, was for a song that he made called uh, "I'm Your Angel" or "You're My Angel," and the really the really touching thing about that is that she was she was very private uh towards the end of her life she, yes. she didn't really like to tell people that she was even sick mm. like uh she kept it to herself so when she sang i'm your angel for her, her nephew um she knew that she was you know about to go oh my so, goodness i didn't uh, i didn't know that story last, that was her last message at least in song was it was i'm, I'm your angel um, and he'll be there. Uh, Donna's sister will be there, oh, wow. who, who's, who looks very much sicker. And I know she has brothers. Uh, yep. I met a few of her brothers there last year. And, of course, Bruce Sedano is uh, her husband, and, and he's he's over in Europe. But hopefully one day we'll have him here and get him, like, a key to the city or something. That would be really nice. That would be really cool. Yeah. yeah. Do you, now, is this also – I mean, I know Together Boston is also being uh, advocating for – a memorial? Yeah, well, there's a or there's a, quite a few people that feel that she deserves something or something permanent. Um, you know what that is? We're still kind of discussing it. Okay. You know, and it could be. We know the Public Art Commission has said we do not want a statue. We okay. do not want a freeze Donna Summer in stone. You know, mm-hmm. which I totally agree with that. Yeah, that's but true. Some kind, yeah, I don't either. Because, the, uh, I mean, but, the music she did just symbolizes so much movement anyway, so it's like it got to be some kind of moving art. Yeah, yeah, some kind of LED thing that mm. is very permanent and very, but but kind of glows and moves and, and like that, that sort of thing. You know, you know some have brought up the idea that it's a, that it's a school, you know, that it's like a, a after-school building, like a state-of-the-art after-school building that teaches digital arts. That would um, be good. That's right up your alley, too. Yeah, because she, you know, when it comes to what they call electronic dance music, you know, she was really the first one. She was kind of like the Elvis. That's of, true, of, actually. You're right. Yeah, I mean, I Feel Love was the first fully automated, you know, 
computerized pop song, really. Wow. Um, so, you know, maybe she's above that building or in that, you know, she just, it's just kind of a living, breathing kind of community monument or something. And then another idea is that it's a brand new state-of-the-art roller skating rink. Ooh. <laughs> I know so many people yeah. actually would love something like that. <laughs> I could put you in touch with some people who actually would definitely be good, good with that because um, I know some owners of some rinks and stuff like that, but they're outside the Boston area. Yeah, yeah, and uh, like an LED floor and lasers and like just futuristic Xanadu style, you know, oh roller goodness. skating rink. Um, and then she's above that. So mm. it really is all comes down to getting our nonprofit started. You know, there's it's a long process to get to do that right. So yeah. uh, and then just kick started as far as I'm concerned. I mean, if she's got, let's say, a hundred million fans in the world, and she's probably a dollar <laughs> and they just give us all a dollar we could create something you know that would draw international visitors that's gonna be mind-blowing i know you're gonna get that started that's really cool so when does everything start on uh friday what time 6 p.m 6 p.m uh, the music okay. will start um last year there was a huge line for the roller skating rink i remember so they've, they've said that they're gonna bring, get a bigger rink this year but if you want to get if you don't have skates uh i would recommend coming early just so you can get your skating in at the beginning um or maybe at the very uh, towards the end when when people are starting to go home and, uh, <laughs> and but you can bring your own i mean we had people dressed up to the nines last year that was really cool to see people getting out their old clothes and you know and, and doing it up so there were uh, a couple lookalikes i remember too Huh? There were a couple of lookalikes, if I'm not mistaken, too. A couple oh, yeah, of we had a few uh, drag queens from um, uh, Perestroika um, Jocks Cabaret mm -hmm. come by, and we were able to get them a budget to go find some of her looks. And uh, they'll definitely be there, um, and, and in addition to the art and, and, and the, the skating and, and everything. Um, so... I got one last question for you. I mean, have you ever, did you ever have the pleasure of checking out a, a concert that she uh, performed at? No, no, mm -hmm. you know, I never, I didn't, I didn't. I, I, I know that I had an opportunity maybe early 2000s. Mm -hmm. She played the city center. Yes. Um, but no, I, I, I haven't. And I brought that up to the Boston Symphony in the sense that she's never really had a tribute concert even mm -hmm. in her, you know, in her honor which I think is insane, you know, not even in L.A. or anywhere. So, like, we should get the symphony and get some big artists to sing, you know, her, her classic hits. That would be cool. Like, maybe like, yeah. a, like an I'll Evelyn King or some kind of Shaka Khan or something like that. Shaka Khan, yeah, totally. And, uh, uh, you know, um, I would love to see a Destiny's Child reunion uh, and they sing Bad Girls, you know. Yo, that's great. I like that idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then I want Rihanna to do uh, Dim All the Lights. <laughs> but we'll see. It's a long shot. She's probably pretty expensive. Hey, if anybody can make it happen, my friend, you can do this. Just say it's going to happen, and it'll happen, Maurice. That's how, that's how it works. So Rihanna, 2016. Dim all the lights, the hat shell, Fourth of July. All right, I'm gonna count on you. I'm gonna count on you for that, real quickly. <laughs> you so keep telling people that that's happening too, and it'll happen. Oh, so if I tell everybody it's gonna happen, it's all set. All right, no, no, no doubt, no problem. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing over four thousand plus people do some roller skating. I'm gonna try to be one of those. Dust my skates off. So you were there last year. Right? Yo, I had a blast, and I actually even saw yeah, myself yeah, yeah. on the TV on news. So I'm like, I'm hoping to catch myself another cameo this year. Maybe I'll catch you on some skates too. I think they've got. I think I do. Think, Susan Tran from Seven News at least said she's already she already put in to cover it. So uh -oh. I assume they'll. So you just can't. You can't not shoot that party. You know, it's true. just like everybody's looking fabulous. You know? True, true, and they're having such a good time. So thank you again for just supplying uh, and transforming a space into something that brings us all together. Pun intended. Yeah. And um, yeah, bring the is... vibes. Bring the kids. You know, let's 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 really just have a good. Good, good time. And, and if it rains, it's canceled. So don't, everybody knows. <laughs> There's no rain date, but it's, oh. it's looking good. Knocking on wood, the weather's looking nice. So, um, Very cool.
I'm excited to see everybody, and you, you as well. Thank you very much, man. Thanks for, for a couple of minutes, and um, look forward to checking you out on the 19th, starting at 6 p.m. on City Hall Plaza in downtown Boston. Great. And if you need to see the recap video, we there's one on the, our YouTube channel for Together Boston. Oh. It's, like, it's like a photo collage. Uh, it's about a six-minute long track oh, okay. with all the photos. So Perfect. Perfect. Get you inspired. I will. I will. I'm gonna definitely. Okay. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna link that to uh, to this story as well. Thank you. Yep. No Th- problem, Maurice. Thanks for thanks, th- thanks for a couple of minutes. I got this.